Hey, what is up guys? Man 4 here, and uh, I'm back with another Minecraft video. It has been a while. Um, I think it's been about two years since I last uploaded a Minecraft video. But uh, what with Minecraft's recent 10 year anniversary, uh, I've been getting back into Minecraft again. I've, I've never really stopped playing it altogether. But over the last couple of years, I've certainly been playing it a lot less, and it just hasn't really been a focus of my channel, but uh, I wanted to make this video to announce I am bringing it back. Um, I don't know how frequent it's going to be, uh, but i um, going to be doing some more different uh, Minecraft videos like Mod Showcases. I want to get back into doing that again. And uh, Village Idiots, that series uh, I've been doing with Prince Bosco and occasionally Doctor Who Boy. I'm uh, going to be bringing that back again as well. And I gotta say, it's uh, a really good feeling to be back at this. I, I miss this. As much as I like doing the Doctor Who stuff, and that stuff isn't going away either, but as much as I enjoy doing that stuff, um, I did miss this. I really did. And so I thought, uh, as part of this, I guess, announcement video that I'm bringing it back, um, I just do a little bit of a tour of um, my main survival world. Uh, this, this is it. Um, I don't know how much time I've spent on here because at some point, for some reason, my stats <laughs> reset, but I've definitely spent a lot of time on here. And um, yeah, so I guess I'll start with this place. This is um, my main house, my, my tower, and uh, it's it's not complete yet. I haven't got around to completing it, but each floor has a different purpose. This is the main floor. I've got a, an automatic uh, smelter here, temporary storage for mainly for exploration. Um, I've got my wall of discs and also my wall of uh, items I can just grab off the wall quickly. Another thing I, I do like to name all of my items something to do with um, uh, alliteration of what the item's called. Uh, so my shield of supremacy, my sword of slaughter, bow of bodaciousness, axe of awesome, shovel of splendor, and I have my pick of power here. I'm using a different one because this one's almost broken and it's too expensive to uh, heal it up. I've also got my rod of radness and uh, yeah I haven't named my diamond armor but uh, yeah, um, so this is the main floor, this is where I sleep, and oh no, a painting died, oh well. This is my access to my automatic smelter. I actually don't know if it works anymore in 1.14 because I haven't played this map since 1.12, but uh, oh well, if it doesn't, I'm sure I can find a way to fix it. Another wart farm and brewing stands, got my enchantment room here. And of course, where we started, uh, the map room. Almost done, my wall of maps, but uh, not quite. Now, this this world is mostly survival. I'll admit, I did cheat a little bit because mapping out all this would have taken so long. So I did change myself into creative and, um, you know, went flying around instead of just exploring it by hand but I, I did like you know get all the materials I needed and all these enchantments and everything are legitimate as well uh, I try to do mostly everything legitimate just every once in a while I do occasionally use cheats to make things a bit easier but all, all the things I make and like all the buildings and stuff and all my items those are all gained legitimately uh, here's my nether portal nothing fancy I don't think I built anything on the other side except for a ladder on the way down, if I'm not mistaken. I don't really spend much time in the nether most of the time. Yeah, I don't have anything built here. This is just my way down. But yeah, nothing special in the nether. I really should get on doing a, uh, a nether base of some sort. That'd be kind of cool. Okay, now over here we have my farm and a little mine down here. So this goes all the way down. Actually, I'm not going to go all the way down because that'll take too much time to get back up. But uh, this is my little automatic farm. Now I do have to collect the items myself, but um, when I press this button all the way over here, 
everything gets automatically mined. Oh, that is laggy. Nice. But yeah, so as you can see, everything automatically gets uh, taken down, and then I just have to replant everything myself and collect all the items myself. So, not 100% um, automatic, but it's enough for me, and I'm, I'm pretty, pretty pleased with it. It's still very efficient and uh, very useful. So I guess now just excuse me as I place everything back. Ooh, I just realized because of the new update, they used to get the uh, the carved pumpkins right from the normal pumpkins. Now you don't. That's a little bit of interesting. Oh, screw this poisonous potato. No one wants those. Alright, and then... Oh, friggin' pillagers. Up here we have my, uh, my farmhouse. First floor is cows. And, uh, oh, just over here I have little, um, areas for loot. And then I also have fence pieces to help whenever I'm trying to bring animals in different places. This is the sheep floor, with all sorts of different colored sheep. Here we got the pig floor. And the chicken floor. And there you have it, there's the, uh, the farmhouse. Oops. I have uh, my little zombie pigman friend who came through my portal, Dick. And I also have myself a villager house where I, uh, I capture zombie villagers that show up and I heal them for my trading needs. So um, thankfully, pretty much all the villagers I previously captured have retained their professions from prior to 1.14's village update. So you got my farmer, Fletcher, librarian, leather worker, butcher, weaponsmith, cleric. This butcher here is the only one that hasn't retained their profession. But that's alright, because we got another butcher here. And uh, i got a couple more spots here to keep some villagers so that I can uh, trade with them whenever I want. I should probably bring you down there too. I don't need you, you're in network. You won't trade with me. And then over here we have my stables with uh, my horses. I don't think I've named these two. Yeah, this one's Sebastian. Is this guy, I think he he's my main guy. Oh shoot, whoops, I didn't think that through. Let me get out. Oh well. Um, but yeah, so basically, you just flip the lever to let the horses out. It's too bad that you can like see the pistons underneath the fences. Not much you can do about that. And uh, oh, I guess I didn't cover the redstone there, or I guess I couldn't because the redstone's uh on this layer, but oh well, tried my, the best I could. This is my storage hut. Um, as you can see, there are chests for a bunch of different kinds of items, man-made blocks, natural blocks, enchantments, potions, mob drops, tools and items, food, plants, ores, redstone, weapons, slash armor, nether slash and wooden stone. And you might be thinking, those are very small chests. You must not have a lot of stuff. Well, I've uh, got a bit of a sorting system. Uh, it's not an automatic sorting system, but when I place them in, they automatically come down to uh, this level here. And uh, yeah, this is this is all all my stuff, all stored away. I did plan on changing up these walls to not just be plain old stone. I guess I never did get around to it. Maybe I'll have to get around to that at some point soon. But uh, yeah. Oops. Okay. And then, oh, we don't want these creepers blowing anything up. Over here, we've got a bunch of different kinds of trees. I'm just missing jungle trees. I always find jungles are like the most difficult to get to. In here is my little fishing house. I'm actually not sure if uh, this still works in 1.14, but this is my AFK fish farm. Um, and. So yeah, this is where I basically just 
collect whatever items I can from fishing. The AFK helps because then you don't have to actively be fishing. Um, and it's a very nice way to get a whole bunch of items, as you can see. But uh, yeah, I'll have to check that at some point and see if it still works in uh, 1.14. But I don't know. Is that guy's right outside? I don't want to do it. I don't want to just keep blown up. Make a run for it. Finally, over here, I do need to build some sort of structure over top of it. Bye bye. But down here is my little slime hole. Um, I can't remember if I ever got it working properly, but I guess we'll find out. This is a slime chunk. I made sure of it. And I've spent a lot of time trying to make it work and I have been unsuccessful. I think this is just lit up right now so that other mobs won't spawn. Yeah, I guess I never completed it. But I wanted a slime trunk to slime, uh, to farm, not slime, uh, slime balls. But uh, yeah, I guess it never got completed. Oh well, I'll have to do that too. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, this is my main survival world. And I am really, really... Oh, no! Whoa! <laughs> I am really, really pleased to be uh, bringing back Minecraft to my channel. And excited about the videos I'm going to be making. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are looking forward to my future Minecraft content. And um, I guess uh, we're going to go forward over there. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you.